Welcome back to the greatest cooking show in human history. You've come home from a long day of work. You want to drink some orange juice? You can drink a whole bunch of orange juice. Mm, I love the vitamin C. You're taking shots of orange juice alone in your bedroom, crying for some reason because you're all alone. You know, I'm upset, but you just want the orange juice to make you to stop feeling anything. It makes you forget all the things that everyone told you growing up that you weren't going to make anything of yourself and that you, you're not worth anything. So we're going to be making a dope grilled cheese for you guys tonight. It's going to be a rom-com starring Matthew McConaughey. And by which I mean, it's going to be cheesy. Ah. <laughs> we have fun here. I'm completely blasted. It's so hilarious because about 20 minutes ago, you were the most sober one of us here. Christ. To make the ultimate grilled cheese, we're going to be using sourdough bread and a combination of Swiss, Gouda and Gruyere cheese. As per the regular rules of, of this series, is that it's all vegan based. This is as far away from vegan as you could possibly get. Because you made a big point in the first episode of being like, this is a completely vegan but show. It's cheese and cheese is not as bad as like beef. Meat. And I, again, when you come home yeah. at this late hour of the night and you've had as much orange juice as we have, you'll forgive yourself for having a little bit of dairy. No. Yes. No. I think he's under something. Oh God, there's nothing I love more than chilled orange juice. Tristan, do you want some orange juice? All right. I'm the cameraman now. Cheers. To uh, <sighs> Timothy Matlack, the official scribe of the Continental Congress. Mr. Matlack can't offend. Cheers. <laughs> I didn't like that. Either. Dude, holy shit. <laughs> so, to start this recipe, you're gonna want some pre softened butter. I would leave it out of the fridge for say. No, you're not, I'm, I'm not ready for you yet. Yeah, right. Leave it out of the fridge for say 10 to 20 minutes. And I'd like some, some sourdough on this plate. Co chef? Ah. Put some, put the sourdough on the plate. Put some sourdough on the plate. Stop, 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 stop. You. Making a mess. You want to shove so much butter in the bread that there is nowhere left for it to go. Just like a stupid amount. An amount that seems unhealthy, but you've had so much orange juice, you don't even care of what your cholesterol levels are. I just want more butter. More butter. Can I get some more butter? I want some more butter. More butter. You're probably thinking, that's enough butter. And you're wrong. We need some more butter. More butter. In the comments, Please. let's rate Cam's accent, one out of 10. 10 if it's sexy, one if it's not. I don't know if you're gonna like the answer. I think it is. It, you think it is sexy? I think it is. I think f the comments, I'm happy with that opinion. So what you're gonna wanna do now is go to your dishwasher where your, your cheese grater is kept. Here's one I prepared earlier. I'm gonna need you to take this pre-opened Gruyere cheese and grate just a big pile of it onto this plate. Okay. You're looking a bit tight here, you need to loosen up. I think I'm pretty tight. Yeah, you know, it's just... <laughs> We're gonna grill some cheese, baby. Whoa! Whoa! Aruba, Jamaica. Ooh, I wanna take ya. Take ya. He's got a good technique there. Okay, chill. You, hold on, pull the plastic back. Oh, I, I dropped the butter knife. Is it just me? Or, um, has, has Thomas gotten uh, crazy with the cheese? It seems like he's had so much orange juice that he can't control his infatuation with the dairy. We better get back up there before he sees us. <laughs> and at this point, it's time to go to the pan. Tommy's had so much fucking orange juice. <laughs> now we're gonna put this on the stove. Once the pan's heated, I'm gonna take a slice of sourdough and put it butter side down. We wanna add all that cheese, really pile it up. Again, you can buy a big block of Gouda and- No more orange juice. Did somebody say, more Gouda! More Gouda! underestimate how much cheese you need. I really want the best for you boys. You want a thick layer, like a, like this much cheese. Layer the other slice of the grilled cheese butter side up, do that on both pieces. Press them down, compress everything a little bit. The co-chef is getting super excited for his upcoming meal. 
he sleeps like that. He um, he eats like that actually as well. Every morning I do this for him. I chew it for him and then I spit it into his mouth so that his, his frail body can digest it. Oh, that's what you want. You want that golden crispy brown. Can we watch an, an episode of Avatar after this? Yeah, but we're in the middle of filming the show that you've been so passionate about. I want about. to watch Avatar. Can you attempt a flip? Doing it totally wrong. I need to talk to you. I understand you're a great chef when it comes to, to French classic meals and and to, and to your f***ing ratatouilles and your f***ing uh, tout de la fruits. But when it comes to drunk cuisines, you're in my ballpark. You're in my dojo. Welcome. Happy to have you here. When you're in my dojo, you don't call the shots. I call the shots. And when I say some sourdough and some grilled gruyere, and swish and halloumi cheese is ready to be sliced, then it's time to slice. And though I appreciate your enthusiasm, I also would request that you f off. Anyway, we're ready to serve the meals now. So we've got our grilled, uh, gr <laughs> amazingly made grilled cheese sandwiches. Boys, I'm glad to provide this for you. Uh, with the help of my co-chef. Co hey, put it there. Cheers. Feel free to be honest. Genuinely, the crunch alone sounds really nice. It's <laughs> dumb. No. Is it actually good? It is amazing. Really? That's so sick. <laughs> I'm so happy. So we're so glad you guys could join us. If, like us, you've had a little too much orange juice in your evening and it's four in the morning, I recommend you try this recipe. You lost some items of clothing tonight. Anything else to add? No.